From Kansas City's breaking news leader, this is NBC Action News. Heading towards the back stick. Until Bunbury! Nice. Yes, that helped clinch the playoffs. That's the man right there. Playoff bound. Sporting KC is the only Kansas City franchise on a hot streak. We have their big star live in the studio. How he and the entire team are getting Kansas City kids into soccer. For any kid who loves the soccer field, it is a dream to test their feet against the very best in our community. And many kids will have that chance tomorrow as McDonald's and Sporting KC host another round of free soccer clinics for Metro Kansas City kids. Joining us today is Sporting KC forward Teal Bunbury. He is here in our studio because he is currently tied for uh, the team lead with nine goals that scored this year is that right this year, yeah. all right and uh, he also scored the game-winning goal on Saturday in our 2-0 victory over the New York Red Bulls that clinched the team's playoff spots we're gonna look at that video there it is all right that's him celebrating first off welcome to the show thank you very yeah much. all right so you guys are doing these free clinics how does it work so uh, the and children in our region they can come uh, uh, to where to get the the free um, clinic well actually this is gonna be the last one uh, okay this is the eighth and final one we've been doing it all over kind of the metro area and this last one's at our training facility at Swope Park and it's uh, for boys and girls from ages 6 to 11 it's about a 90 minute clinic and uh, it, it just gets the kids involved, uh, works on you know their skills, and and also to you know have fun. Do you ever think soccer will become a um, a big sport like football one day, where uh, you know all the children you know will be watching it? I, I feel like it will. You know, it's it's a young sport here mm -hmm. in, in the states, and I really feel like it's growing, especially here in Kansas City. You could tell that the youth is really really interested in soccer, and that it, and that it's growing. Yeah. Do you see uh, when you, at the games more and more people going uh, to uh, fill the stadium? Yeah. I mean, we have an amazing stadium, Livestrong Sporting Park. I mean, they just opened it up this year, and you know, every game it's it's an amazing feeling to play in front of those those fans and just kids who come out to the games too. What made you guys gel this year compared to last year or the year yeah. before? Because the last time you guys were in the playoffs, according to this, was in 2008. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, I, there were some ups and downs this year, but the biggest thing I think was uh, our winning mentality, and we didn't, you know. We, we, we stayed on that right course, even though we were maybe losing games or things weren't going our, our way. We, you know, we stayed focused and, uh, you know, we, we kept getting the job done. Yeah. So um, I'm reading here that you guys are tied for first. Uh, that is amazing. What's the competition like next? Uh, we have a game uh, on Saturday. Um, we we still got to win that game in order to you know clinch that number one spot. But uh, after this, it's the playoffs start. So well, our focus is to get ready and tuned for for the playoffs, and that's going to be a grind and it's going to be a battle. Yeah, it will be. Yeah. Will we see any playoff games here in Kansas City at, at uh, Sporting KC? Yeah, you know, it, at your stadium. Yeah, it depends on uh, you know where we finish uh, in the Eastern Conference. If we finish first, I believe we should have about two games okay. in the playoffs here. So uh, I still got to figure that out myself. But yeah. uh, right now we're trying to focus on our, our next game, which is Saturday against D.C. Cool. And uh, it's going to be very exciting. Well, I can't wait. Best of luck. And I know you guys have done extremely well. Um, so where is the last clinic again so people know? It's at Swope Park. Okay. Um, and it's at our training facility. And it's... Uh, yeah, it's, it's from 5 to 6.30, and uh, it's going to be a lot of fun. So I encourage all the kids to come out, parents. It might be a little cold, but, you know, get yeah. them bundled up and, you know, bring them out. Yeah, get them excited yeah. for it. Yeah, so this is the McDonald's Free Soccer Clinic. All the information is right there on your screen. You can also get more information on our website at NBCActionNews.com. It's the final one. Might as well. You know, the temperature is going to be uh, colder and colder, and they're not going to be out in the field as much. So Bundle do them it. Up. Yeah. Bundle them up. Teal, man, it was good meeting you. Yeah, very nice yeah, to meet you, Yeah, too. nice goal there. I thought we would have all the cheering yeah. and, you know, <laughs> you know, all that for you, but uh, you. congratulations. Appreciate it. Okay, let's go to George Wallenberger now. Yeah, and you know,